Hey, this is uh, Guitar Preacher Channel. Uh, I'm Pastor Fred. This is the follow through. And um, today I want to talk about a little bit about one of my favorite bands, uh, Striper. Um, and listening to them for a long time, they had a song called In God We Trust. And uh, what a great song. Uh, maybe I'll put a link to that in the description uh, because, you know, they were commenting on the, those words that, uh, as the song says, that we, we see every day. Uh, we hear it every day, right? If you have money in your pocket, right? It says, in God we trust. In God we trust. Do we really, though? That's, that's the question. And, and all week we're going to talk about God's protection. Uh, and so those go together, don't they? Like if, if I trust in God and if I really trust him, I know he's going to protect me. And so I'm not going to expect some of the other things in life, like maybe the government or uh, my finances or, uh, or any of those things that, that promise safety and security, uh, right? We, we even call it social security. Um, you know, I think sometimes we, we trust more in the money than we do the God who we reference on it. Uh, I think that was the point of the song, right? And I think that's the point we want to talk about probably all week. Um, David in Psalm 91 says this. This is such a great passage. This is one of those where like after this is over, just read it a couple times, let it sink in. This is one of those like men, like marinate in it, if you will. I know it sounds kind of weird, but you know, uh, it's just so good. Uh, here's what David says. He goes, he who dwells in the shelter of the most high will abide in the shadow of the almighty. I will say to the Lord, my refuge and my fortress, my God in whom I trust. Again, in, in him I trust. He is my refuge. Look, look at those things. Um, he, he's where I can find shelter. And, and what he's saying is, it's not just, uh, listen to this, it's not just like, hey, the person that, that every once in a while reaches out to God is going to get help from him. Yeah, I mean, I think that's true. But what he's saying is, the one who actually dwells in the shelter of him, like, like lives with God's continual care, knows it, trusts it, is, is just so, like, it's so apparent in his life, and actually abides in his shadow, abides in, like, God's, over God's protection. Like, like, like he's just, he's not trying to run out from it. And that's what we do. We're like little kids. You, you know when you're trying to, like, you're at an amusement park, and you want to try to keep the kids near you, and they just get so excited, they want to run out ahead. We, we do that to God, I think, a lot. They say, just stay close. Stay close. Stay with him. Because that's our refuge. I mean, he's our fortress. He's the one that we go to when we need help, when things seem overwhelming. And maybe you're feeling that today. I want you to know that just, just stick with him. He's got you. You can trust him because he's all these things and more. And he's got us. So, so let's remember that every day. I'm Pastor Fred. This is the follow through. Hit that subscribe button and share this with someone and we will talk to you next time.